Horizon Forbidden West, release date, PS5 exclusivity, new gameplay, and everything we know so far. Welcome back to another interesting video of Top Mainstream. Guerrilla Games, Horizon Forbidden West, and a new gameplay trailer has shown us just why it's top of our list of upcoming PS5 games. Hero Aloy has learned a lot since we last saw her in Horizon Zero Dawn, and it looks like she's going to need all those skills and gear because she's up against some new and epic enemies. If the landscape looks a little different in the sequel, that's because Alloy is now exploring a sunnier new territory, which includes the remains of San Francisco. Her new toys match the environment, a pullcaster for climbing, a shield wing that works like a Mary Poppins umbrella to make leaping from great heights a viable option, and a diving mask. The game also features a big new selection of deadly machines, promises Ben Maga, narrative director at Guerrilla Games. Sun wings in the sky, Claw Striders and Shamor Tusks on land, Snap Maws, and the smaller, yet not to be underestimated, Burrowers in the water. That's only the beginning, as many more will be revealed throughout the massive open world of Horizon Forbidden West. You'll have to be smart and creative to take them all down. Horizon Forbidden West will be released later this year on PS5 and PS4. Want all the juicy details? Here's what we know about Horizon Forbidden West so far. Horizon Forbidden West release date. Guerrilla first announced Horizon Forbidden West in June 2020 during Sony's PlayStation 5 reveal event. At the time, it was planned for a 2021 release. However, pandemic caused delays. By August 2021, Guerrilla revealed a new Horizon Forbidden West release date of Feb 18, 2022. For now, it looks like the studio is still on track for that date. Horizon Forbidden West is a PS5 exclusive, and also coming to PS4. At least for now, if you want to play Horizon Forbidden West when it's released, you'll need a PS5 or a PS4. Though it's worth noting that its predecessor, Horizon Zero Dawn, is now out on PC. But there are no guarantees Horizon Forbidden West will follow the same path. With the PS5's SSD, there will be virtually no loading screens. Game director Mathis De Jong said in a recent dev diary. In an open world game like Horizon Forbidden West, if you open up the map and fast travel from one end to the other, or restart from a checkpoint, it will be super fast. When you boot up the game, you're right there in the action. Horizon Forbidden West Story Horizon Forbidden West continues Alloy's story as she moves west to a far future America to brave a majestic but dangerous frontier where she'll face awe-inspiring machines and mysterious new threats. But the trailer tells us a little more. The landmarks clearly show a post-apocalyptic San Francisco, with a Golden Gate Bridge that's been overtaken by greenery, and the Palace of Fine Arts ruined and underwater. We can also see that Silence still has a role to play, and Alloy will meet other tribes as she explores the new world. Alloy heads to the Forbidden West to uncover the cause of a strange crimson blight, which is killing off plants, animals, and tribes, not to mention turning the local weather into a non-stop superstorm. She'll meet new tribes, including a hostile tribe capable of overriding machines, and face dozens of new machines as she searches for a way to cure the blight. The latest video shows us the Tanakh tribe, who use the local wildlife like weapons and some new creatures to battle. If you find this video entertaining, then do consider to subscribe to our channel. We bring such cool and interesting videos to entertain you on a regular basis. Gameplay and huge variety of weapons. Alloy still has her trusty spear and bow, with various arrow types, take on her new foes, but she also has some other new toys to play with. The pullcaster speeds up climbing, getting her quickly out of trouble. The shield wing allows her to safely descend from great heights or surprise enemies from above, and with the diving mask, a whole new underwater world is open for exploration. Bows with specialized ammo types strip armor off machines to expose their weak spots. Adhesive grenades can be fired from slingshots, temporarily stalling foes. 60 FPS mode and other advantages on PS5. Guerrilla Games confirmed that the PS5 version of Horizon Forbidden West will feature a 60 frames per second mode, double the frame rate of the original PS4 game and the recent gameplay footage. Game director Mathis Zhang said that because of its power, the PlayStation 5 can go much further. Visually, we can add a lot more detail. Graphically, the rendering technique for the underwater scenes is special for the PlayStation 5. It has extra details and extra systems like the wave technique is better on that system. On top of this, the lightning on Alloy on PlayStation 5 has much more definition, as they use a special cinematic lighting rig that on the PlayStation 4 is only used in cutscenes. But with the PlayStation 5, we have plenty of processing power, so we can have that lighting rig always available, so she always looks great with that lighting setup traveling with her anywhere. But PS4 owners shouldn't be worried about the game's performance. According to Dijong, a lot of the development has taken place on the PlayStation 4, and a lot of playtesting has been done. So we are ensuring that owners of that console have a great experience and the game will look fantastic on that console. Climb anywhere and swim underwater in a larger world. 
Following the new footage of Horizon Forbidden, players can expect more freedom in free climbing. You can now free climb anywhere in the world, thanks to an automatic system that just detects if there is a latch somewhere in the geometry of rocks, cliffs, and mountainsides. Horizon Forbidden West will also have a larger, more dense game world than Zero Dawn. The map is a little bit bigger and has more content, making sure there's a lot more to do for the player across the map, and then making that content also engaging by telling little micro-stories. Horizon Forbidden West Soundtrack Gorilla and Sony have released the first track from Horizon Forbidden West soundtrack on various streaming services. The one featured in the first trailer for the game, prominent Dutch video game composer George Deman wrote the score titled Promise of the West. So with this ends our today's video. We hope you have enjoyed the video, and if you do, then make sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel, Top Mainstream. We will bring another exciting video very soon. Till then, peace out.